Six talking points as lingered error cost Man United in Champions League opener. Cristiano Ronaldo continued his brilliant start to life in Manchester, but young boys made sure to spoil his champions' homecoming for United. The 36-year-old made it three goals from two games since rejoining the Old Trafford side as he opened the scoring with an instinctive finish, but the Swiss side secured a stunning comeback after Aaron Juan Bissaka was sent off as it finished 2-1. It was a perfect start for United after Ronaldo put the visitors in front, but the right back's lunge meant they had to defend their lead from that point on. Young boys eventually got on level terms in the second half thanks to Maumin Gamalou, and then sealed all three points in injury time through Jordan Sibachu after an error from Jesse Lingard. Here are the talking points from tonight's Champions League clash. Everything Cristiano Ronaldo touches turns to gold as he continued his hot start in a Man United shirt against young boys. He followed his brace on his second debut for the club at the weekend against Newcastle with another goal tonight. And he showed first-class anticipation and movement, like with his two Magpies strikes, to put United in front. Bruno Fernandes played an exquisite ball with the outside of his right boot to find his compatriot as Ronaldo squeezed his effort under the keeper to make it 16 consecutive seasons he has scored in the Champions League. The 36-year-old is already making a huge difference for the Red Devils, and any criticism of his signing is now looking extremely silly. United were in a great position after their early goal, but Aaron Juan Bissaka's lazy challenge changed all that. The right-back was correctly shown a red card for the tackle as he caught the player on the ankle and all of a sudden, the game had a different outlook. Ole Gunnar Solskjaer was forced into changing his setup as Diogo Dalot replaced Jadon Sancho. Young boys took the initiative from that point on as they would complete the comeback. A huge turning point. Jesse Lingard made a massive error as his slack back pass cost United dearly. He inadvertently played in Sibachu who secured the win for the Swiss side with a cool finish past David De Gea in stop page time. United did ever so well to put themselves in a position to leave Switzerland with a point given they played the majority of the match with 10 men. The frustrating thing for United is that young boys' winner was completely avoidable, all they had to do was see out stop page time. It was a terrible mistake from Lingard who came on in the second half. It was a lack of concentration as he didn't look who was behind him as he played in Siba Chu who would be the hero for the home side. It was Sancho who was the unlucky player that had to be taken off to accommodate Juan Bissaka's sending off. And it won't have done his confidence any good after a difficult start to his United career. He started on the right-hand side to start tonight's match, but the change didn't really work as he was wasteful in the final third. He was having a poor game up until the red card, so it made sense he was the one who was hooked. Martin Keon was on commentary on the game for BT Sport and reckons the decision could hurt his confidence. He said, Sancho's confidence won't be any better after being dragged off in that manner. Donny van de Beek had a chance to revive his United career as he was handed a surprise start. But, likewise to Sancho, it was a poor display from the midfielder as he was taken off at half-time. It was partially a tactical decision to bring on Rafael Varane as the Red Devils looked to defend their lead, but he struggled to get into the game in the first period. Van de Beek's confidence is at an all-time low at the moment, and it will have taken another hit after his early substitution. It was backs against the walls for Solskjaer's men in the second half and eventually, they gave in to young boys' pressure as Ngamalu scored an equaliser, before Sibachu would scored the winner in stop page time.